Off the coast of Southern California in the Channel Islands National Marine Sanctuary, Jesse Allstadt is busy doing some gardening. This, however, isn't your usual type of gardening. She's underwater, planting eelgrass to restore damaged habitat. Eelgrass is one of two types of vascular plants that grow underwater. Thriving only on sheltered sandy seafloors, these meadows provide beneficial habitat for many unique creatures. This lion's mane nudibranch uses its large oral hood to capture prey that floats nearby. The eelgrass serves as a nursery. This tiny juvenile California halibut, hiding in the sand beneath the blades, can grow to over five feet in length when it becomes an adult. Eelgrass is sensitive to water pollution and needs clean water to thrive. It is an indicator of a healthy environment. In the past, out-of-balance sea urchin populations have overgrazed the seagrass meadows. Currently, the biggest threat for eelgrass in the Channel Islands is damage caused by boat anchoring. Anchor chains create large barren areas within the eelgrass beds that take years to regrow. By being aware of these habitats and anchoring outside the eelgrass, we can avoid such damage. After years of seeing the decline of eelgrass with very little natural regrowth, we decided to take things into our own hands and restore several meadows around the Channel Islands. The techniques we use are actually amazingly simple. It's gardening, but it's underwater. So what we do is we transplant healthy eelgrass from a neighboring bed and we bring it to our restoration site and we just replant it. Since we started the program, we have successfully grown acres of new eelgrass meadows. The eelgrass is doing so well at this site. We saw so many different species of fish. There's huge schools of jack mackerel, at least five different species of surf perch, so many invertebrates. The project is doing so well because this is a sanctuary. It's really important that we as stewards of this national treasure that we call the Channel Islands do everything we can with modern technology to avoid damaging these precious natural resources. Healthy eelgrass beds support a wide variety of creatures, like the territorial sarcastic fringehead and this pike blenny that is giving a mating display. These eelgrass beds are part of a marine protected area that exists within the Channel Islands National Marine Sanctuary and the Channel Islands National Park. Safe havens like this help replenish life in surrounding areas. With continued restoration efforts and protection, we will be able to enjoy, learn, and appreciate all of the extraordinary life that lives within the eelgrass gardens. In the meantime, I'll be back underwater, watching my grass grow. <laughs>